ඔබේ පැරණි ශ්‍රවණ උපකරණය නවීනතම ඔටිකෝන් ශ්‍රවණ උපකරණයකට හුමාරු කර ගැනීමට විෂන් කියා ශාකාවට අදම පැමිණෙන්න The speaker of the house Karujay Surya entered parliamentary chambers amid tight security where the first order of business was to suspend the standing orders He later went on to adopt the no confidence motion against Prime Minister Mahindra Rajapaksha and the ruling party following which a vote taken by voice call Barni istira kala diya subandir subandir mandura istira kala bar kiwada ema yojana istira kirima ema yojana istira kirima party leaders in the opposition however who met with the president on thursday night pertaining to the no confidence motion were given instructions by the president to hold a vote while respecting standing orders and parliamentary norms Issuing a media communique, the speaker's office said that the no-confidence motion, which was presented by MP Anur Kumar Desanayake and later seconded by MP Vijay Herat, was passed in Parliament yesterday. The communique further went on to note that the list with signatures of 122 parliamentarians supporting the no-confidence motion was also sent to the president. Meanwhile, representatives from several political parties met with Speaker Karuja Surya and held discussions at his residence at 6:30 last evening. Amata karagatta. We inquired of the latter. informing the president that the no confidence motion was passed the speaker said that a letter has been sent to the president we hope that a new prime minister will be appointed in place of this defunct government alut agamettume ka anduwak patkarai kela be bala poruttu wenawa meanwhile representatives from the ruling party met with the president around 7 last evening at the presidential secretariat the president said that how they went about showing the majority in parliament is wrong and he did not comply with the instructions given by him the instructions were to adhere to standing orders but that wasn't the case a no confidence motion cannot be tabled against the president in parliament and that clause was also not removed therefore he said today's vote is invalid and he will not accept it We were asked to work towards showing our majority. The president also called for stability. Vistadavangyak ganama pahadi istavar bhavayak athi karaganne kiwa. Ege budumala ma dinthiri aanduwa to budumala da. Pissu nathuwa. Da UMP eka bara ganna kiwa. Ranil Vikram Singh agamethi neme ne me rata janatha bala poruth wenna Ranil Vikram Singh agamethi kawata pat karai kiyala. Ranil Vikram Singh ne me Sajith Premdasa dehena. Ne, hema ekak ne. Ape bahuthare ethula api hada ganna. Ege bahuthare nahe nathama. Ege ay golanta bahuthare thiyenawada. E golan kiyen thiyenawa kiyala. Koheth thiyenne. Where is it? His signature has been collected to convene parliament a show of majority. The president clearly stated that he will in no way form a government with Ranil Vikramasinghe. He told everyone to join hands and work with discipline in parliament and as for parliamentary norms. What he said was that we acted this way because there was no other choice but he advised us to work peacefully going forward can a speaker call for a vote while having a mace near the doorway the president instructed not to take a voice call on the vote violating standing orders but that too wasn't followed the speaker plunged the country into chaos no matter who is appointed as prime minister it will not be ranil vikramasinghe agamathi pat karana kota mona hetu wenne sawat ranil vikramasinghe nawata me rata agamathi wenne na thanayaka thumaada man katha thanayaka thumaage putuwa isara inda i stood before the speaker yesterday and asked him to adjourn parliament he said he will not i then told him there is a chance that a couple of people might perish the speaker responded saying that it doesn't matter how many people die and i have it on record on my phone i am keeping the record in case an investigation is launched mangeka surakshitwa tiyagini 